automotive eye candy for miles and miles here at the annual SEMA show. And we are loving it here on Motorhead Garage presented by NHOU Protective Coatings. Over 1,300 companies have their wares on display here trying to lure some 70,000 buyers from all around the world. It's clear that the automotive aftermarket industry is hitting on all cylinders, but it's facing some potential obstacles in the road ahead. Well, one of the big concerns here uh, at SEMA and with PRI is uh, regulatory overreach by the government that could really limit this industry. We're seeing it with the EPA as they ramp up enforcement of the Clean Air Act, so that's why SEMA for the last five, six years has really pushed for the RPM Act, which is a clarification of the Clean Air Act, and that will help us protect the modification of street cars to race cars. So this is an opportunity for the individual to get involved and help with this fight. You can go to saveourracecars.com. We make it very simple. Put in your name and your zip code. We have a pre-populated email. We'll pull up your representatives. You hit send and you are now communicating with your Congress people and your senators and do that. Get the RPM Act on their to-do list send another note a week later. If they haven't responded, ask them why. Ask them how important the RPM Act is. Tell them why racing is so important to them. Saveourracecars.com, let's get it done. The SEMA show highlights all kinds of different fads and car crazes, but the donks are here to stay. There are donks and there are boxes and there are bubbles, and we got a great example of a classic donk. In fact, this is the Blue Magic. It claims to be the fastest donk on the planet. It's got a turbocharged LS, it's convertible, little nitrous, exactly what you need to go fast with these giant, what are those, like 26 inch rims, unbelievable. It's a thing, donks baby. This is an immaculate 1972 Corvette LT1. In fact, it's only one of 27 ever built. It is amazing. Everything on this car is original. Oh, except for one thing. And this looks just like the original stereo, but it holds a secret. What's the secret, Ryan? That secret is our newest model, USA 740. The thing about custom auto sound radios is they're built to look like an original radio when you're sitting in the car. But the surprise is, this unit is a high-powered modern unit. You're looking at 300 watts, Bluetooth, auxiliary inputs front and rear, USB, you name it, whatever device you have, you can run it through this and you can run it with nice, clean, clear sound. Popular with original builds because it keeps that original look. And I know a lot of folks do resto mods or hot rods, want to put new chassis underneath new suspension and all that stuff. So they're finding out they don't want to settle for the same old sound either. That's right, absolutely, yeah. I, I, you're going to spend all this money building out this beautiful car. Everybody that owns a beautiful car has a soundtrack in their head. They have a song that they want to listen to while they're cruising their car. And we provide that opportunity for you to keep that dash original. The original touch points, original feel of the car, but all that modern sound and all your favorite tunes. And the great thing about it, it's not just a good looking radio, it's a high quality radio. We go through an extensive testing process. Every single radio that leaves our building is quality controlled twice. In addition to that, in our 40 year history, we've developed a lot of proprietary technology within our builds of our radios. Incredible technology packed into this unit that looks just like the original. You can get one at customautosoundmfg.com. The Auburn Boat Tail Speedster, the ultimate hot rod, 1930s. This one was built in 1968, called it the Phantom, and I absolutely love it. John D'Agostino, known for these cars, and the metal flake is spectacular, but all the detail, the looks, obviously the exhaust pipes coming out through the side of the fender, maybe not exactly functional now with a 327 with three twos under the hood, but just the look, the sexiness of a car like this, it pops years later after it was built here at the SEMA show. For 75 years, Hunter Engineering has been at the pinnacle of innovation and technology when it comes to automotive equipment. We've seen their automated tire mounting and balancing equipment. You guys are really all about alignment equipment here, John. The business is evolving, so how is Hunter Engineering evolving with it? Wheel alignment has been a key aspect of Hunter technology for a long time. But with today's vehicles, the new systems that are on today's vehicles called Advanced Driver Assist Systems, part of the alignment of that car is maybe calibrating some of the systems on that vehicle. So we have developed some really cool new technologies in the cooperation with Bosch, where we have the capability in an alignment bay to take care of the alignment needs and any of the ADAS calibrations that are associated with that when you service the vehicle. In this day and age, people want to stay home to get a lot of the services they used to have to go out for. Uh, you brought a mobile service van with you here. It's unique. Never seen anything like it. How do you get all of Hunter Engineering's equipment in that van? 
Our van has a hot swappable system where I can actually pull a tire changer and balancer out in five or six minutes and maybe convert that van into doing another type of service like oil changes or AC service. So it's a really unique design to be able to service the customer's needs at their home. After 75 years, Hunter Engineering is still at the leading edge of technology, American technology at that. You can find them at hunter.com. You know, you can find anything you need in the automotive world here at SEMA, whether you're talking complete builds, car parts, or tools to get the job done, it is here. And when it comes to tools, nothing is more useful than the Magic Creeper. You're going to find it is the most valuable tool in your toolbox. Yes, it is a creeper. You can get under your vehicle, but it's way better than a traditional creeper. Zero ground clearance on this thing. No big casters to take you up close to the vehicle. You get under the car with plenty of room to spare, and you're able to move around and maneuver better than a traditional creeper. When you're out there, maybe in the gravel, working in the yard, shade tree mechanic out there, a regular creeper is not going to be able to move around and maneuver like this thing. The Magic Creeper glides over gravel, tree roots, even glides over tools if you leave one laying around. Also, the Magic Creeper is really handy if you have problems beside the road. Keep it in your car. It only weighs three pounds. You can roll it up, keep it in the trunk, and when you get a flat tire, you whip out the Magic Creeper, kneel down, change that tire, keep your clothes clean and dry. It'll also save your knees. The Magic Creeper is only available in one place, magiccreeper.com. We'll return with more Motorhead Garage presented by NHLU Protective Coatings from the 2021 SEMA Show. When we come back, do not miss it.